Okay, and uh, this is Abdul Rahman uh, Let's come back to math concept. Uh, for now, we are going to do a math concept of primary. And uh, we are going to start a chapter called Money. This chapter is very much examinable, and almost 12 questions will come from it. Then, uh, we have different concepts here in this uh, chapter called Money. We have the likes of uh, and profit and losses, discount and percentage discount. We have uh, commission, we have higher budgets, we have bills, we have post of charge, we have also telegram, and as well we have uh, simple interest and common interest. And uh, we are going to run all of them, inshallah, uh, within the course of the week. But today's program, uh, we are going to cater for uh, commission and percentage commission. Commission. And percentage commission. Now, for your information, this chapter is very much acceptable. And we said commission will come in every exam. So, yes. So, our students expected uh, actually and uh, to cater for this concept so that he or she uh, gets the correct answer during examination. Commission refers to payment for service. Uh, rendered. So we have uh, this formula for mathematics. We have commission is gotten by percentage commission times value of goods divided by 100. This is the formula that we'll be using. This is the formula we'll be using for this concept of mathematics. We are saying commission can be abbreviated or contracted as C is equal to percentage commission times. VG, which is the value of goodies, all over 100. Take your time and enjoy uh, the life of mathematics here. And in the examination now, you can be asked to look for a uh, commission. You can also be asked to look for percentage commission or the value of goodies. This 100 here is constant. Nobody is going to ask you during examination. Then a student is expected to know how to get commission uh, percentage commission and value of goods. Don't worry about that. I will write for you uh, the formula of getting each one of them. And let's ex uh, start uh, how to get, we start from how to get commission. And uh, let's see this example. We have Osman. Osman is paid. Osman is paid. Osman Spade and a, percent, a commission percentage commission percentage of 5% for any sales uh, of goods for any sales of goods full stop the, the question here is how much How much commission did he receive? Did he receive in a month? In a month, he sold goods worth. Shilling twenty five thousand. Look at this question. You are told Osman is paid a commission or percentage of five percent for any sales of goods. It means there's no condition here. Any sales of goods this guy uh, make is going to get what a commission of five percent, and this is what you normally call percentage commission. You are asked. Look, that we said in mathematics, the last full stop is very important. Look here. You are told how much commission. So you are, you are expected to get what? The commission. We write the information here for solution bar. We have percentage commission, which is equivalent to 5%. Write the information given. Okay, we were asked to get the commission. That's what we are told. Then we are also given what? Value of goods, VG. That's the sales you made. That is 24,000. But remember, we said for commission, we said that commission is equal to. 
The Civil Commission times value of goods over 100. Look at this formula. Commission is gotten by percentage commission times the value of goods sold divided by 100. So you're going to say our commission now is 5%. 5 times the value of goods, which is 24,000 divided by 100. Then cancel these two. Two zeros will move with two zeros. Then you are left with commission is equal to 5 times 240, which is shilling 1,200. This is the commission he's going to get out of the sales, this guy is mad. Okay, that's how we are going to get our, our commission. Remember we have uh, the simpler part of commission and the more complex part of commission, where you are going to see the total value, uh, uh, sorry, the total uh, earning, we have uh, the commission, we have uh, and, uh, the back uh, way of solving commission. We will see them, God willing, inshallah. This is how we are going to be there. Uh, commission. Commission is gotten by percentage. Commission times what? Value of good is uh, divided by 100. Then I told you I, I told you at the initial point that uh, in the examination room, you can be asked commission or the percentage commission or what? The value of goods. But this one is constant in the formula. So now let us now see how we are going to get a uh, percentage commission. How to get the percentage commission. Let's write example two. Let's write example. Example two. We are told a salesman is paid. A salesman is paid a commission of a commission of a commission of shirendati for every item sold. For every item sold. Full stop. That is the commission. You are given the commission. You are told if each item, if each item, if each item costs share 600, comma, express, express, his commission express his commission express his commission as a percentage as a percentage of the sales as a percentage of the sales now look at this question you are told a salesman is paid a commission of shilling that for every item so we have the commission now so we're going to say for the solution part, we have commission. Share that. Let's read the statement here. You are told if each item costs, that is the value of goods. Value of goods. VG is what? Share 600. Then remember, we have only three here. We have the percentage, the commission. We have also the percentage commission of the value of goods. And if they ask you in the examination one of these, remember they will give you the other two. So what's under question right here is what? It's percentage commission we don't have. This what's under question. But remember we say that according to uh, our initial formula we say that look at this point here. We say that let's write the formula. The formula is what? Commission is equal to percentage commission times value of goods all over 100. But this time we are expected to get what? Percentage commission. So, if you have a formula that contains numerator, first what you're going to do is, and, uh, and you want to get one of the variables there, what you're going to do is, you multiply both sides by the numerator. You want to get percentage commission. I want to drive the way you're going to get your percentage commission in the examination room. We will multiply both sides by the numerator, which is 100 in this case. Cancel these two. Be very clear. We have linear equation, which is 100 times what? C is equal to percentage commission times what? Value of goods. Remember, we are, we are looking for what? For percentage commission. Then, we eliminate this one by division. Because here, the relation is multiplication. We say, you're going to say what? Uh, divided by VG here. Yeah? Divided also here. Yeah? VG. Cancel these two. Take your time. Percentage commission is equal to 
100 times commission all over value of goods, GG. This is how to drive. The formula of getting what? The percentage commission. Now you have the information, that information here. We're going to say percentage commission there is equal to 100 times my commission there, which is 30, divided by what? 600. 20 and 20 will move. You are left with what? 6. By 6, 1 by 6, 5. So it will be how much? 5%. This is the way of getting the percentage commission uh, during examination. Check your time. Know how to drive uh, the formula of getting uh, the percentage commission. For your information, now we have learned uh, how to get commission and the percentage commission. Then we will proceed ahead and see how we are going to get our value of goods. How we are going to get what? VG. Because I told you at the initial point, I told you that the, from this formula, there are three variables. From this formula, we have three variables. The three variables can be asked in the examination, but the constant. That's not in the, in the formula can never be asked during examination. So now let us see how we can also get our value of goods. Our value of goods, VG. Let's see how to get a, a value of goods, which is what? Which is VG. Let's write this example. Let's write this example. We are told our example one, this example three, sorry. A uh, dealer, a dealer paid twenty thousand to an agent, to an agent. Then this one is very important. You must underline an agent. We are going to give you the meaning of this one. Don't worry. As, as a commission, as commission for what? As Commission for a car. Full stop. So that for the sale of a car. For the sale of a car. Full stop. The commission was the commission was the commission was ten percent. Of ten percent of the price. Full stop. What was the selling price of the car? What was the what was the selling price of the car? What was the selling price of the car? Look at this question. So a dealer is paid, a dealer is pay, paid, sorry, a dealer paid, she paid 20,000 to an agent. The agent is the person who's, uh, who's actually carrying out the transaction between uh, the dealer and uh, the person who's now uh, buying the, the car. Don't forget, that's called an agent. Yes. A person who also sells, uh, a person who also sells land for a landlord to uh, to a land tenant or maybe to another person is what you normally call an agent for information. Then solution, the solution part is very easy. Write the information given. We are given information. Our commission is what? Share 20,000, right? 20,000? What else? Read the question. We are told uh, as a commission for a sale of car, the commission was 10% of the price. So this is the percentage commission. 10%. Our uh, percentage commission is what? 10%. So we are missing what? VG. VG is the value of good, yeah? Yeah. So we are, we are going to write the formula. We are going to say, we are going to say, we know that commission is equal to percentage commission times value of goods over what? Over 100. What you do, we want to get this time VG. Multiply again by this side 100 and this side also 100 to eliminate the denominator. Cancel. We are left with 100 times commission is equal to percentage commission times value of goods. This time we are I for what? We are looking for I for what? For value of goods. Then eliminate the other one. Percentage commission here. Here yeah, also percentage commission. Cancel. You are left with what? VG, which is the value of goods. 100 times what? Commission all of a percentage commission. Please make sure you know from today how to drive. Yeah? 
all of the, how to drive the formula of creating all of the, the variables here in this formula. Now we are going to say Vg is equal to Vg is equal to a hundred times the commission rate, which is twenty thousand, divided by the percentage commission. Cancel out these two. So we have here two thousand multiplied by hundred. Vg there is equal to Shiran. 200,000, that was the sale of the car. And this is the final answer for your information. Then, uh, in our next class of commission, we are going to see uh, the more complex part of commission where we are going to see what you normally call total annie, which is quoted by basic salary plus commission, plus other related uh, concept of commission for your information, which is very, very much examinable. And, Otherwise, I wish you the best, then you will catch up with us in the next class. Uh, good really.